Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, so we're back on Frostpunk. Uh, so in the last episode we just completed this uh, this expedition and we are we have the option to send our scout onto Steel Bridge, which is a new city. Um, so I think I think I might I might I might do another I'm gonna do this, but I think I'm also gonna do maybe add another scout team if that's an option so let's head back into the city we've got food problems at the moment but meals are being created um, we can't do a lot about that until the evening when the hunters go out we've got a third uh, we've got a third hunt hut now too cold oh this is because of the cold snap okay so let's turn the heaters on in there Um, right, secure at least livable living conditions in homes. So where have we got a problem? Is it this? What's this? This is a this is a new steam hub. So that should have yes, we've done that. So maintain at least livable conditions in homes. We've completed that that job there. So what's next on the agenda? Construction. I think we've pretty much got um, everything we need really at the moment. People working here gather resources from nearby coal piles, wood crates, and steel wreckage. I don't think we really need that to be honest. We've got loads of coal, we're still very limited on wood, so we need this. Uh, we need to build a sawmill. Just trying to remind myself what I need to do to, to, to do that. Um, I've got a load of people idle at the moment, but that's like, I'm kind of alright with that at the moment because it's very cold. We run out of raw food. We've got teams out here on this still. Wood production crates. So, what time is it? It's, it's one o'clock in the afternoon. So, we're a bit, at the moment, we're a bit kind of stuck until this finishes um, and this happens. So, I think we're going to fast forward on for a little while. Okay, we've got some frostbite happening. Someone's just been bravely ill. Mild frostbite. And we've depleted that wood supply. So we're definitely in need of. Definitely going to be in need very soon of uh, the sawmills. Hope is good. Discontent is pretty good. Food is our biggest problem at the moment. No one's starving yet. We have 26 food rations. Temperature's going to go up soon as well. Sawmill research, great. Okay, so it's slowed back down again to pause in fact. And we can add some new research into here. Um, I think we're going to get the coal thumper going as well. Um, is that is that a coal? No, it's not coal mining, that is it? Hmm. By pumping pressurised water into underground coal deposits, the coal thumper washes the pressure resource to the surface. Okay, let's start doing that. Those guys will be there in five hours. They've got a load of meals to bring back, which is great. Is that what they've got? I think that's what they've got with them at the moment. Just doing that. So close that one down. So. Can we construct a new? What did we just build? The sawmill, okay. So we need this, and we need this right out here by the looks of it. Oh, no, we don't. Destroy resources. So let's just have a quick read of that again. Turns frozen trees into usable material, producing 80 wood per da standard day. Right, there's, there's loads of wood out here. We don't want to build it on the things actually because that will 
And has this got its own, does this generate its own temperature? Base heating within one, yes it does. So we could actually, by the looks of it, we could place this out. I'm not sure this is a good idea, but I'm going to go for it. I'm going to build a strew in there. So first kind of branch out from the main town, the main city. So let's get that going. Got a lot of people off work at the moment, but I'm all right with that because it's really cold. Um, can we do a new scout zone? We'll look at this right now. So I need 40 wood to create that. Five people hungry at the moment, so that's good, that's going down. Um, can we put people to work in here? Functionally, we could not, oh, because we haven't got any more food. So we've only got the kids working in there anyway at the moment, which I'm fine with. We've got, I think we've got enough meals to get everyone through. So they all go out in the night. That road is going up. What's this 15 out? Oh, coal is low. Oh, goodness. I'm glad I noticed that. It doesn't seem that low. 14 hours. <coughs> So I can because I can only put one team on this at the moment. Might have to put them on double shifts though. I'm not gonna like that. But not a lot we can do about it at the moment. Let's put some guys out there. I can put more into this by the looks of it as well. Street is not connected to the generator. Okay. What? Why does that not mean I can't? Does that mean I can't do it? Does that mean that's not going to work? Oh. Well, it let me build it there. That's very annoying. So these guys have made it. Brass plaque on the so bridge to winter home. Explore. Brass plaque on the bridge towards the bridge sorry, bridge tower reads built by the people of Winterhall home in AD eighteen eighty seven. The bridge is can kept is kept completely snow free by a working automation. Explore that. So this is our new thing: automation, function auto. Oh, 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 sorry, automaton. Bit of a different word. We stopped at the edge of a deep, wide ravine, marvelling at the steel bridge spanning it. Even more so at the huge automaton sweeping snow from the roadway. Oh, it is like a robot thing. Cool. That's something new. It would be possible to send the machine back to our city for this assembly of resources. So new sites discovered, weather station and large convoy. So two options here, send it to the city. I don't know what we'd use it for, but we'd get an automaton, send it to the city, we'd dismantle it and give us a load of steel. I don't want to send it to the city. We reprogrammed repro the automaton and sent it on its way. As it disappeared in, in the distance, walking steadily towards our city, the first wisp of snow started to set on the bridge. Okay, I kind of want these guys to come home now. Because they've got resources on them, haven't they? They've got a load of food. What's this area effect? There are two types of building with area effect. Some buildings, like sawmill, have an area from which the resources can be gathered, and some others, the areas in which they can affect people. Okay. So 
So was I supposed to build it over and over the wood? Because I thought that was a bad thing. So it's to destroy destroy stuff. I want these guys to come home now. There's my automaton. Find another setting. What are these? Lost expedition. I'm going to go back and get those guys. New scouts report. Day 9 from arrival. We enter the camp appearing out of the driving snow. Require excited voices welcome us. Thank God you found us. Been wandering for days. We're ready, we're so ready, aren't we? Yeah, we're ready, we're Gonna go back there though. I don't want to get too far away with them. I think they've got... Oh, okay, so they're gonna go fast on the way back because they know the route now. I think these guys are carrying resources, so I want them to come back because they've got a load of meals on them. What's happened here? Deserted bridge. Finding a bridge to Winterhorn home provided proof that we were on the right track, but raised questions. Why was the bridge deserted? Why wasn't the automaton under the care of an engineer? There are logical explanations to it, but people are growing anxious. So hope is fine, discontent is fine, no one no one's sick or ill at the moment. Um the problem is being dismantled. Streets not connected to the generator. I don't know I don't know what I don't feel like I did anything wrong there. So now I've used all my wood up to get oh, is this gonna be a real problem? Do I not have any wood left? I don't know if I actually have any more wood to gather as well. It's the night time. Oh, we should be we should be putting everybody in here. Oh my god. I hope that isn't any more than starve all of a sudden. No employees. Why am I no employees? I've got 17 left. Because they're all out there doing that. Oh, let's just speed it up a second. Let's get those guys back. Coal supply is getting very low as well. We need food. These guys are going out. I'm just waiting for that number in the bottom right corner to tick back up to the people I know I've got idle here because Oh that's the cookhouse that we're talking about. It's this one. Why are these guys inoperative? Oh, because it's not is it not warm enough? Is that what it's telling me? It's not normal. I've had overdrive running the whole time. <clears throat> it looks warm enough to me. Oh, it's cold though, isn't it? Chilly. This one's not. Yeah, okay. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to get by with just the one. One lot then. Right, we need guys out and calm. Coal is falling really quickly. Oh dear. This is obviously too cold to operate. I don't have any other way of heating it up right now. Another steam hub. Which I could do. Put that out here, can I? What's going on here? Turn off the overdrive. Quick. Stress levels too much. 
Nav is freezing. Oh, discontent's gone massively up there. I had to turn it off because I had it on for too long. What's the time? 7 a.m. So we've already we've already had our chance to get all the to get all the bills. Yeah. I'm a bit concerned that we might have run into a dead end here because I've got no wood or seemingly any means of getting wood because it's coal, that's steel, what's this, coal, can't do anything about them, can't seemingly get Oh, okay, so they've reached their destination. Have they got they've got wood on them, okay. So get those back those guys back to the city, they'll bring two hundred and fourteen with them. And the automaton is there. No idea what this thing's gonna do. Um so we are in dire straits again because we can only get coal get coal is going up we've only got four hours of coal left and everybody is out getting all the coal we can get yikes there's kind of not a lot of point in Oh, I can boost this. I can boost the range on this. Okay. So it's set, the moment's set to 24 hours. Range setting. Can't increase the range on it yet. It's because I've got all these, um, these extra coal things, I think. So let's set this to... Well, that's not good. Why would I want it on that? Work day. It's going to make everybody cold at night, isn't it? Surely. Okay, well that's gone to six hours. We need the we need the wood team back. That team with the wood back. Speed this up. Food is dire again. Oh dear. Mild frostbite. Citizen became gravely ill. And they don't they're not appearing on my gravely ill list. I'm just going straight into being treated. Coal thumper researched. Master gathering. Guess that's gonna be important. I feel like we need to upgrade the hunting now. Get that going. And everybody's going to get hungry again, aren't they? Because we've got issues. Okay, well they bought food back, they bought wood back. Perfect. So that's exactly what we needed. So I've got to get a sawmill built. Try not to screw this up this time. Building here will destroy resources. Well, that's what it just showed me in the thing. I really don't want to waste the materials on this again. So I'm really hoping that just works. Um, can I do a coal thumper as well? I don't know where I need to put this. Well, that's cleared. Oh, that's quite cool. That's actually cleared the snow there. I think I need this within range of the generator. Um, I don't want to block off the street. So I don't want to put it there. Hopefully this is alright. I 
hope, I'm hoping that means as soon as I've done that, that I can actually start to use that coal, otherwise we're going to have a problem. Coal thumper. Coal thumpers wash, will wash coal from cracked and rock to the surface. You can order people to gather the coal from the piles directly and employ them in gathering posts. We've already exhausted all the coal though. We need a mine, we don't need... We need a, we need a mine now, we don't need the, to use the piles anymore. Right, what's the scout team doing? Let's send the scout team out to... I think these are, maybe these are ones we've done, yeah they are. Let's send them out to Gloomy Cave, it's not too far away. And I think maybe I can also do a new scout team now. So that's all the coal gone. This is this is worrying. Nine hours of coal. Or eight hours. This overdrive is off. What are these things? So let's turn this to. Is that the end of a working day already? It is. Right, so we need the food again, don't we? So let's get the guys back in here. I feel like I've actually got more people than I'm using now. Um, workers on construction duties. And we're going to run out of coal, aren't we? Is that not the simple fact here that we're just going to run out of coal? There's no way of turning these things off, is there? Well, I, need, I can. No, I need that one on because that's heating that whole neighbourhood. Food was an issue there briefly, but it's not now. I think I can turn this one off. Let's see. That's closed. This doesn't have a problem with cold. And they're doing their work. So that's full. There's some space in there, some space in there. So they're all going to go out and get raw food. Hopefully we'll get enough raw food. Six hours. Six hours of coal though. Oh, it's coal there. We've got 15 guys getting that coal. Right, speed it up a bit then. So it's going a bit long this episode, but um, I'm just wondering to see what's going to happen in two hours when I run out of coal. I think we're going to have real problems because isn't Aren't we just going to... Isn't this just going to turn off? <laughs> it's going to freeze to death. <laughs> oh, God. We need... I mean, basically, as soon as the light comes on, we need everybody up here getting this coal. There's 15 guys already on it. Um, but... Whether we get away with that or not, I don't know. Zero hours left. Generator is shutting down. We're out of coal. <sighs> oh, what is going to happen? I think we are going to wait and see what happens for the next episode, guys. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to call it there. And we'll come back and see if everybody dies in the next episode. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, this is Frost. This has been um, Frostpunk, um, and we shall catch up next time. Have a good one.